Hi. In this lesson, we will learn how to prevent a specific value to be entered in another range. In this example, we have an IB. We have to assign an IB for each employee name, but we have some IBs they are already taken or reserved for a specific machine. What I need to do, I need to prevent any entry for any IB of this one. So if I try to insert any IB from the list, I will get an error as this IB is reserved or taken. This is the same file, but right now I can insert any IB even if it is already taken. Okay, to do so, my first step is to convert this into a name. I will use a shortcut Control Shift F3 to insert a name from selection using the name in the top row. So this range will be named as Taken. So now if I go to the Name Manager, we have a name called Taken, which refers to this range. Now if I select this range from data validation I'm going to type my own so I'm going to refer to custom equal count if taken any value I have to insert here if we count in taken, it must be equal to zero. So data validation will only allow any value which is not in, in the taken range. Then I have to type my error alert, let's say wrong entry. This IB is taken. Let's try. But if I try IB, which is not in the list, let's say 9, 9 is not in the list, so we can't type it. 